Hey guys, Matt Waxler back from Wheels Through Time Museum. Beautiful fall day here in Maggie Valley. We got out the stunning 1939 Harley Davidson Knucklehead. This bike coming up November 14th is gonna find a new owner. That's right, you can win this motorcycle coming up in just over two weeks. 1939 Harley Davidson Model EL, 61 cubic inch, four speed transmission, restored right here in the Wheels Through Time restoration shop. This thing is absolutely ready for the road. Uh, and we're going to be finding it a new owner coming up on November 14th. Tickets, 10 bucks a piece. You can buy three for 20, seven for 50. And we've got packages above that. Make sure you get a chance at winning a piece of motorcycle history. Today, we got the bike out. We're going to show you how to ride it. So I hear from a lot of folks, oh, I can never figure out how to ride one of those old motorcycles. Seems like there's too much going on. So today, we're going to fire this thing up, take it down the road, and show you how easy it is to ride, own, and maintain a 1939 Harley Davidson knucklehead. So first thing out of the box, what we're gonna do is take you through the starting procedure. Some of you guys may have seen this before. First thing, turn the fuel on. There's a fuel shut off right over here on the left side gas tank. Turn the fuel on, pull that up. Now what we've got, throttle like normal, spark advance over on this side. So we'll retard that spark just a little bit. And what you're doing is you're making the spark happen just a little bit later. Makes the bike easier to start. Over on this side, we've got the choke. Okay, your choke on, off, and then there's multiple clicks at which the choke is partially on. What we do is put the choke fully on, give it three prime kicks, one kick, two kick, three kick. Now we got some fuel right there in the carburetor. Choke is back off, ought to be key on, and fire it right up. So here we go. All right. So as you guys can hear, this thing is absolutely dialed in. The motor's quiet runs and operates just like a brand new motorcycle so starting one of these is as easy as it looks riding one is just as easy guys so checking it out what we'll do is straddle the motorcycle kick stand up front brake is up here on the hand rear brake is on the foot pedal just over on the right side so throttle like normal spark advance you hardly ever got to mess with it so the way to engage the drive on this, you've got a rocker foot clutch pedal. With the Harley Davidsons, we say toe to go. So what you'll do is you'll heel that thing down up here to the tank shift. First is one back. And then you just ease right into that toe. We're ready for a ride. to take you through the shift pattern on this particular motorcycle now 1939 they had a real complicated shift pattern first second neutral 
then third and fourth. So neutral was right in between second and third gear. Only did it one year, really unpopular. So what we did on our raffle bike was set the bike up with a standard shift pattern. First is back, then neutral, second, third, and fourth. So considerably easier to use. One more time, I'm gonna take you guys through how to in engage the drive, disengage the clutch on a bike like this. So we're in neutral right now, toes down. And remember, Harley Davidson, toe to go. Real easy setup. So we'll heel that down, pop it into first gear. And then as you can watch the foot, we ease right in and we're off again. Excellent. There you have it, y'all. 1939 Harley Davidson Knucklehead, the 18th annual Wheels Through Time raffle bike. We're going to be giving this machine away November 14th. Make sure you get your tickets. Head over to wheelsthroughtime.com. Check out our ticket options one for 10, three for 20, seven for 50. You get a free t shirt and a DVD. And there's packages above that, guys. Make sure you get a chance at winning a piece of motorcycle history. Matt Walker from Wheels Through Time, guys. We'll catch you next time.